bit of fun here with uh, with our friends from Hampton Farms. They are the sponsors of what we call the Big Blind Draw. And if you've ever been involved in a cornhole tournament, you know what a Big Blind Draw is. It's an opportunity to play with somebody maybe you've never played bef with before. But this particular case, the Hampton Farms Big Blind Draw, has now morphed into something else called the Hampton Farms Big Blindfold Draw. And uh, this is a little different than most corn player, cornhole players have ever done. So we're going to throw it out to the center court. And the cornhole dude, Frank Gears, talk to these players and let them know what it is they're about to do. Oh, Finn, thanks a lot. Uh, we got, a, again, the Hampton Farms Big Blindfold Challenge here. And I'm going to give both of you gentlemen a blindfold that I'm going to need you, require you to put this on. Put your bag down on the board, please. <laughs> Appreciate it. Blindfold on. And while you're putting the blindfold on, I'm going to explain what's going to happen here. Shane. Those are stunning. You got it on? Can you see me? Burton no. Grimes, Doesn't Shane like Smith. Me. Burton. Come over here. All right. So, Shane, odd or even? Evens. All right. You get the choice of throwing first or second. Which one do you want to do? We'll go first. You're going to go first. All right. So now what I need both of you to do, all this is, is you're going to go down. All right? Mm -hmm. You're playing for Hampton Farm Peanuts and some extra cash on the side. All right? So the player that scores the most points, you're scoring this just like traditional cornhole. One point on the board, three points in the hole. All right? But it's he who scores the most wins the bill. All right? And so you wanted to pitch first, right, Shane? Yes, sir. Let's take it away. All right. Well, uh, you've heard uh, Frank here as the cornhole do lay this out. Shane Smith out of Sykeston, Missouri. Now, the way that this is going to work is one time down, as we made mention of, and all he has to do is get one on the board. And, oh, it's just a dirty bag, just, just a little bit shy right there. Now, one bag on the board is one point. One bag in the hole is three points. My guess is we're going to see no points on both sides because we tried this all day today, and not one of us could get anywhere close. <laughs> now, part of this with Hampton Farms is they have a program they're working out this year called Play for Peanuts, and this was something we thought would be a lot of fun. That one's not going to count. We're going to have to clear that off. But it's an opportunity to make a little extra money. Now, last night we threw 50 bucks down out of Frank's pocket. Nobody got on the board. Nobody scored anything. Phillips, so we've yeah. rolled it over. So tonight, whoever wins, if they if somebody wins, it's a hundred bucks. If nobody wins, oh, oh man! <laughs> <laughs> and the reason the reason that everyone is laughing is the reason you don't see that anywhere in the frame on the picture. We're gonna have to get a separate. Uh -oh, camera. Oh, oh, we have a <laughs> might have a cash winner. He doesn't even know what he's yeah. done. How about that? Shane Smith just puts one in the hole. There's three points right there. All right, Burton, good luck. Try to keep it in the building, brother, if you can. <laughs> Uh, and so, again, the money was going to roll over if nobody had made it. <laughs> if no one had made it tonight, rolled to 150 yeah. But we already have ourselves a $100 yeah. winner. He's playing for a few extra peanuts here. Is he going to get oh. it again? Oh, almost. Well, I'll tell you what. Show off. That's what, what. After we tried this like 15, 20 times oh, least this afternoon. I was lucky I didn't take yeah. out one of the cameras with a, yeah. with a bag earlier. But I, with my blindfold off, Philip, I'm – not that much better, <laughs> to be honest with you. And this is another one from Burton. It's found itself two zip codes away from the board, and that's yeah. going to do it. How about that? Shane Smith grabbed himself a little extra cache. He's playing for peanuts. He grabbed an extra 100 bucks yeah. in the big blind fold challenge, thanks to our friends from Hampton Farms. That was nicely done, that $100 being handed over right there. Yeah. Burton, nicely done. We're going to go uh, see if we can get AAA to help us find the bags you threw. And now we are going to put our players back on center court, and we are going to determine our Owensboro Major Championship doubles winners right here, right now. So it's going to be Isaac and Caleb Hurt, who you just saw double dip Russell Tabers and Craig Irvin, against Sebastian Barger and Bracey Blanton. They are in what yeah. we know as the king seat.